built like the one they describe in that book I got, uh, uh, the 12 tribes. In the 12 tribes, dude was described the Jew. He smelled like him Jew too. was living around that this motherfucker, uh, his clothes, he never took them off, he never bathed, but his clothes, when he got a new pair of clothes, that's when the pair he got on literally disintegrated off of him. Now imagine that. Your clothes disintegrate, look at disintegrate. They, they say they, that's all they, uh, they would never take them off until they do disintegrate. And they, that, they, to them, that's called holiness. Right, 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 right. And that's what he looked like, man. And he was talking, you, you should have heard what he was saying. Bless you guys. Bless you guys. I love you guys. He, what? Some, he got hit with speak. got stricken with something. Oh, uh, you know he bugged out of his blessings. Yeah, right, right. And that was, a, that was a real, that was a real Edomite, man. That was a real Am uh, It was like a retarded Amalekite. Right, Amalekite. I can, I can tell him, I can even get it out. Amalekite, I guess. Amalekite. Am 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 Amalekite. Yeah, it is hard to say, Amalekite. Mm -hmm. And that was a real one. That was a real one, man. Hey, that man's rich, man. That man got money too. You remember? You, was you there? Was yeah, he, you lives in, in? he lives in Bexley. Yeah, huh? Yeah, he, lives in he sure does. Yeah. Yeah. He got half paper to live in Bexley. Fuck yeah. That man had money, man. You know, when a family member, when the parents die, it don't matter if the child is fucking adult, grown ass man. When the parents die, the children receive a million dollars. Just from death, man. Even if they're retarded. That's a, they get a natural. Insurance in here, like we got to go pay for our life insurance and shit. You know. I just got there. Hi, oh, what's up, bro? I like them people. You like them people? Hell no. They can go to fucking hell. Who's that? <laughs> you have a reaction to it. They can go to fucking hell. Uh, Who is maybe it? They are. I don't know. They I don't are. believe in hell. They are. Well, they, well, they are in hell. That's what I mean. You know? Well, they're in heaven. They don't. Right. They, 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 they don't know? understand what I'm getting. I guess. Uh, well, I bring up people like. Buddhist teachings and the Hindus and Plato because they <laughs> see all there is is the Bible. This, I grew up in with South it. Florida. I like the pictures. I spent the first nine years of my life going into the ocean every day. Okay, I didn't know there was white black people. I didn't care. I mean, I saw them every day. They were from the Caribbean, the black people, and they spoke better English than me. I was so people on the islands are usually going like Benjamin. Oh, you got the Israelites. Curse. Yeah, I don't get into that. I should have been. Well, Israel. I grew up like a hippie. Well, Israel scattered among all nations. You know? I understand that. We're the most numerous people on the earth. I don't know. There's more Israelites on the earth than okay. any other people. That's why when you go to other countries, they, people might look like heathens or whatever. They have different cultures, different uh -huh. customs. But you be feeling their spirit like, this, this is my friend. You know what I mean? You see many examples of that guy. I tell yeah. them, I go, hey, Shua Messiah. You know, instead of saying that Jesus is God. Because I believe, you know, my father was Jewish, but he was killed when I was seven. So I'm a Christian, but I'm not, it's not that Your dad simple. was killed when you were seven? Yeah. He died working on his job. He died in an industrial accident. That's been a recursive. I understand. I don't depend on my father. I depend on my mother who took me to a Baptist church. And then I saw, when I got to Houston, Texas, I'm going to one of the biggest Baptist churches in Houston. Guess what? No black people allowed me. There's something's wrong about this. Wow, I quit going to that church. <laughs> and then, then when I moved to Indiana, I'm going to a Methodist church. Right. It's like this is like a yeah, Roman like, Catholic church. All these a lot of them Christians they'll teach that yeah they'll teach that black people had the mark of Cain when really it's the other way around. I don't have, I don't want to deal with any of that because only God knows. But I understand how you're trying to get to correct interpretation because we all got to share what's left of the church. Well, I mean, you actually have to. We got it. We got it. Okay. Yeah, you got to strive for, for perfection. Of course. Oh, so you, you believe that the, 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 the Jews that don't believe world, Jesus is who he said he was, they're like telling. living in the old covenant. You know, and that's the angels doing it. Wait, what's that say again? The Jews that don't believe that Jesus is who he says he was are living in the old covenant. Well, we don't believe that the so-called Jew today is actually a real Jew. Because uh, when you look into the history, you know about the Khazarian Empire and all that stuff. The what empire? Khazarian Empire. The Khazars. Oh, where are they from? They're from Khazaria. Like most of the Jews, so-called Jews today, that's living in the state of Israel, you'll find a majority of them are from Poland or Russia, you know, somewhere. Oh, else. okay. Yeah, I understand. You know what I mean? Yeah. that That's because they're in exile. So, that empire was based on... What kind of people? Because they, com they, com they uh, converted the so-called Judaism in what, about the sixth century A.D. Uh -huh. So, well, 
I just consider that so if convert to two yeah. thousand levels turn to physics. Yeah. Why well, convert? What is there some like oh, I feel like I'm a sinner now, so I gotta quit being a sinner and now I'll believe in God. <laughs> probably just all politics. You know, a lot of people converted to so-called Christianity, yeah, just for political reasons. Like the Norm that. like the Normans, you know? Yeah. I I my best so-called Christian friend is a Quaker. You know what he says about all this? He goes, it's real simple. You got the light inside of yourself, and then you have the people that believe in the Bible, but they're not living by the Bible. So the Quaker said, we've been discriminated since the Puritan English Revolution. We got kicked out because the kings and queens said, we don't want any strict people believe in Jesus. You got to do something for the king or your country. You got to fight our wars. You got to so. So the Quakers, you know, they were the first people that uh, went to jail and uh, uh, protest against slavery and wars and all this serving the political elite. They go, we don't serve the people. We don't accept the worldly church as representing God either. So a lot of them got really, really pushed out of pain. Well, well look, even in early America, though, look at early America, so-called Christians. A lot yeah. of them, even like the Puritans, you know, they outlawed Christmas. They did? Yeah, because, you know. Oh, I remember that. Like, you know, like the regular run-in-the-mill Anglican Protestants, they accepted Christmas and uh, sure. Easter. Yeah. And all that. You know, Christmas used to be illegal in America. A long uh, time. Well, it's based on a pagan holiday. Right. The real Christmas is every day. And then the real Easter is every day. That if you get beyond Jesus Christ dying on a cross and paying the blood for your sins, well, this is a spiritual covenant, isn't it? You don't worry about bleeding to death, me out here. Hey, don't worry about bleeding to death. Hey, let's get that. Uh, where was you reading something? I'm going to get that second, uh, second Corinthians. What is it? So that, your man? blood is sacred, right? Let me yeah. look for it real quick. I believe mine is. Yeah. <laughs> But these bodies is, hey, these bodies I got a scripture for that. Get that, uh, uh, Colossians. Uh, yeah, these bodies Do you believe that the empire we're in now was uh, copied? These people that are politicians, if they copied the Roman Empire, the exactly. Greek oh, yeah. Empire, exactly. the British Empire, exactly. the Mughal Empire, they've Babylon, been copying ancient all these Babylon. People. They've been studying the wrong literature. No, they're not stupid. They're fools, but they're not stupid, though. Yeah. I, that, when I left South Florida, that was my favorite thing to see in New York. I lived in New York City. I can't wait till they get destroyed. Oh, uh, oh it's going to be destroyed. Your royal blood. Huh? Get that Colossians 1 and... Uh, yeah, one in twenty-six. One in twenty-six. Actually, start at twenty-five. Actually, start at twenty-four. Do you do you like the first people I'm I met? That wasn't at. my race. This one's better. I, I would like, but I'm okay. There's uh, people from Jamaica, and you know Bob Marley. Remember, he used to go to God. He was talking about uh, the first Christian empire was in Africa. Yeah, he was quite spiritually. Uh, yeah, there you go. He knew he was the spirit. Yeah, he, he did a lot of mistakes, like all rock and roll stars. Think of things that, well, if you're so into jaw, why do you need marijuana? That comes from India. Ganja's river. Ganja. Okay? It's not an African herb. Don't criticize any reason. There may be a few of us that live in the but don't know yeah, because there's Israel scattered in Ethiopia. Because the first church that was in Ethiopia, that's in Jerusalem. I'm saying the first so-called okay, New you. Covenant yeah. church in Africa. Yeah, I won't, get, I won't go into what the Muslims started doing. Oh, the Muslims are white. Oh, God. Hey, we got a scripture yeah. to go to Kurt He okay, said you. his blood was royal, right? He says, Colossians 1 and 24. Uh, 24 to it's our 24. There's so much good stuff in there. You got to read it. Uh, he says, now we, he says, who now rejoice in my suffering for you, and fill up that which is behind the affliction of my God. Christ. He says, in my flesh, for his body's sake, which is the church. Wherefore, I am made a minister according to the dispensation of God, which is given to me for you to fulfill the word of God. Even the mystery, which have been hid from ages and gen from generations, but now is made manifest to the saints. Now, what's that? That mystery. The mystery, you know, the mystery. Scripture speak of that mystery of the Gentiles too, about how Israel was scattered among all the nations. That's the primary theme of the Bible, is how Israel got scattered. That's why when the Lord, the one they call Jesus, was he said Yahweh Shai. When you go to he the ancient Hebrews, Yahweh Shai is not Yeshua. That doesn't okay. even line up with the way it's written. Okay. Uh, but uh so, say? Yeah, Israel, that's why he said he came for the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Hey, read the rest of that though. There's more to it. 
It says, even the mysteries which have been here from ages and from generations, but now it's manifest to the saints. It's being to, made manifest right now. Go ahead. To whom God would make known what is the riches of the glory of this mystery among the Gentiles. Yeah, that mystery among the Gentiles. What is that mystery among the Gentiles? It's That's our why the worldly church thinks we're all sinners. Well, I don't believe we're sinners. Well, I believe we're suffering. We're all sinners. Go ahead. Well, that's, I don't. We're all, the Lord said there's nothing to do with good. It's good to say. I understand. I take. Because at the end of the day, we're all big pieces of shit. Yeah. Paul said that he was the essence of Second Corinthians. said that uh, he was the greatest of all apostles, but at the same time, he said he is nothing. Right. You know? He, he, I have a Son of God on DVD. I have a... <laughs> What I'm saying. Uh, no, my so best DVD about the real Jesus is called Jesus of Nazareth, made in 1977, produced by Italian TV, directed by Franco Zuffarelli, yeah. who later did Shakespeare on film. He directed, he studied under uh, Lucino Visconti, who was a Marxist guy from uh, uh, Italy. Yeah. And he said. That wasn't the one with William Defoe, was it? Uh, that's not. Uh, that's Mark Scorsese. Oh, that's right. That's right. You're right. This one had Lawrence Olivier, Anthony Quinn, uh, all these international stars. Yeah, okay, I've seen that one. At that time, and it's seven and a half hours long. It gives you enough time to compare. Well, I don't have enough time to see the Bible and imagine it's being put on your screen. So it's the only reliable film I've seen about Jesus. And she frankly said, really, she bears female. He, he directed, he directed oh, Italian oh, opera before he oh, yeah. So he's into the passion of Jesus, not just, you know, he was like, he might have been homosexual, I don't know. At that time, you know, if you got enough money and you got good karma, you do what you want. Okay. You believe in Christ, right? I believe in Christ. You believe in Christ? Of course. So you know he only coming for these people right here. That's the whole, I agree with that. The whole thing. And let me finish up that scripture right there, because there's the last part we got right here. Who would preach, warning every man, teaching every man in all wisdom, that we may present every man perfect, and you have my shot, you have shot. We're on two, I also labor, striving according to his work. Hey, scoot up a little bit. Uh, what's that one where it said, uh, the mystery of the Gentiles part again? To whom? Says, to whom God hath made known what is the riches of the glory of his mystery among the Gentiles. Which is Yahweh Shai in you. Yeah, which is Yahweh Shai in you. It says Christ. What do you think the main problem of the Gentiles is? They don't know how to do it. Well, they don't, they, don't, they don't feel that the human being, the only purpose is to love God. Secondly, you have to make a sacrifice of your life. You're sacrificing your lives to do it. This is going to come by and kill you. This well, is a sweet savor. Present your body to the living sacrifice. We're that, yeah, we're like the Lord uh, put himself up as a sacrifice, so we follow his example. My biggest problem is I got bronchitis. I have to keep my chest wrapped right. up. Right. We all we need yeah. these sick bodies, man. Yeah. So, unfortunately, yeah, yeah. I grew Tim up Timothy was all going to the up. beach every day. It's like when Jesus lived, wouldn't you say he was outdoors and there was bugs and it was hot and it got cold at night. There wasn't fresh water. There wasn't clean food. And he was homeless. There you go. So, he, said, he said the son of man have nowhere to lay his head. Yeah. I'm living like that. Yeah, people come up, make fun of us, and call us bones. Well, I've heard everyone that is mentally ill, oh, the Jehovah Witnesses, they're a cult. Well, I go, at least they believe in the Bible better than the other compared to uh, well, anybody the Mormons. That, anybody that worships anything is a cult. I agree. Because well, the word Latin is a, is a word I was, that means to worship. I was giving them the example of Plato. Remember Plato invented democracy, the politics of the city. The worst possible form of government in yeah. history. But before that, he was talking about the soul, the analogy of the man is like in a cave and he's coming to the light. Yeah. There was no religion back then. The Greeks were killing everyone, and Plato says, well, these warrior kings, they don't represent the glory of Greece. So he's talking about the policy of the cities. He was from Athens. Yeah, but Rome right on. copied all the Greek uh, right. empires, weapons, destroyed you and I. They came over the that Legion, that though. The Legion defeated the Phalanx. So, uh, the yeah, you keep going. What's the opposite of violence? Huh? What's the opposite of violence? Violence? Yeah. Well, it'd be doing what we do, mercy. Have mercy on people. Be peaceful enough to share what you have. Yeah. Everything you have don't belong to you. Right now, a whole lot of bad is happening anyway. Well, this 
going to get worse. You know, so some do have on 23 in because they predicted it. I seen a, I just seen a post come out and it said uh, some cop just committed suicide because he was uh, they was having him trained to to kill U.S. citizens uh, preparing for the upcoming economic crash. Wow. They said they've been training SWAT teams, police forces, National Guard to, to uh, the amount of stress. They, That's real too. They've been practicing to go door to door to take all the weapons. Are you allowed to have weapons? Yeah. But this is our main weapon. Of course. I gotta go get some uh, kosher food. That's why I don't collapse. This is revelation. Look at you. This is gonna be the country. This is gonna be the whole I like broccoli. This is my favorite kind. And it will be just places like isolated like Texas and Florida. It's gonna be the whole country at one time. So they already prepared these police. Trump already armed the police with the best equipment he, he, from the military. He just passed that uh, executive order giving all the police a military grade equipment. That's right. So, so Donald Trump with yeah. the police having all this good equipment, when the society break down, they're gonna have easy access. Have to you ever lived in New York City? Gathering the people up because they're gonna do it. They got these giant warehouses like Walmart, you know, or whatever other places they close because they close a Kroger's up by me, a Giant Eagle. And they ain't using buildings for nothing. They're gonna, they gonna fall on people's asses. Up in those like in the Walmarts, they're gonna use Walmarts as the uh, 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 detention centers. That's like right. During Hurricane Irma right. down there in Houston, they just clearing out Walmarts, put people in. That's beautiful. Oh, God. They've been saying that's been a conspiracy I theory spent for years. Four and a half years yeah, in that yeah, city. Yeah, that yeah. city is so. And they're big. gonna do it. It's like Los Angeles. Just like they're doing Lord in Texas judgment and Florida. On. They're yeah. taking oh, the people in the camps, bigger. and they, they're uh, some people they're they're giving them psychological tests. Wonder why? Why ain't you in these buildings? Why? Ain't you, why? Why didn't you come seek shelter? You better not say, uh, well, you know, I was warned by the Israelites. You know what I'm saying? Don't say that. You know, don't say you against the new world order. You know, but that's why they're doing that, man. Well, anyway, they give the people you know the real name of Donald Trump. Chip. They're oh, chipping I, I, the people I, I, I up. I want to talk about he's talking. About. You know, they're chipping the people up. You know, detaining them. You know, some people, some of them, been in handcuffs for days. They even took them off, you know what I'm saying? That's this devil ain't got nothing good compared for us, man. What are you talking about? What's that on your social security? You ever, have, you ever been in handcuffs? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Have you? Multiple yeah. times. You're right, you're right, you're right, the police right. thought you were dangerous. Huh? All right, we're all well, criminals. All the same thing. If your license, you know, if your license plate Personal lights out, you're going to handcuffs. I never this, this owned a car. Playing, I never owned a car in my whole this life. I never owned a phone in my whole life. I don't have a legal ID. I can't vote if I wanted to. You understand? I'm already out. Well, listen, you can talk listen, all that listen, fancy listen, stuff you want. They're going to beat your listen, ass. Man, thank you. You're going to be forced to take the chip. You're going to either, you're going to have a choice to die or take the chip. It ain't going to be no sign the contract. Ain't going to be none of that, man. And besides, a lot of these people, stomachs going to be swelling. They got babies to feed. Right, he probably already got it. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you, brother. He probably already got it, man. I, I, I think Right. Well, a lot of, well, that's how it's you know those that's how Jehovah it's Witnesses? They got, you got your the guy's pulling out. He, he depends on the Bible, but he's got all this stuff. I'm too poor to depend on that. I just read the King James Bible. Consider that. Well, check it out. How long has this been going on? Elizabeth I I don't care if my citizens are Protestant. You go get some As long as they don't kill me. She was preparing that. Okay. Remember what her father did? Sorry, but he like. Yeah, well, you do try to stay in order once, but it, it gets confusing. Right. 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 You know what's funny? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's real. That's real. Keep out from there. That's real, man. Hey, man. Reproject Magneto, too. Reproject Magneto, too. Oh, we're going to see in the We're going to be in the kingdom, King. Peace, my brother. We're going to drink that good wine in the kingdom. You know, yeah, these people don't realize, man, that the, the, this devil about to turn the lights off, man. He's about to hit the switch, you know? They out here having a good time, man. You know? It's all about good time right now. You know, that's what they think. That's it's all about. Good I grew up time like right a hippie. Now. There is no good time. It's gonna get us a temporary of illusion of God's energy. Yeah. Temporary illusion. Go ahead. You got me the first step. Okay, okay. Here, here, here. Revelations 12 and 12. <laughs> Therefore rejoice ye heaven. Ye that dwell in them, woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, 
for the devil has come, for the devil has come down into you having great wrath. That's right. Because he know that he has but a short time. See, Esau knows his time is clicking. That that sand, that that sand clock is clicking. You know, the sand yeah, clock. The hourglass. There yeah. it is. He know his time is coming. He got to a couple the little grains left. Right. Like drop so out. why why you think you see these hurricanes that are three four times bigger than a normal hurricane? That's because they got these weather making machines that's controlling these. And they done perfected this technology a long time ago, man. And it's called heart. Act, uh, uh, what's it called? High frequency active uh, rural research program. They don't even call it project no more. They call it program. Right. The chemtrails got something to do with it too. Every right. day you look up in the sky, they spraying us every day. And then the government openly tells you they claim it's uh, to combat the weather and global warming. That's correct. Warming. Do you remember 2001 A Space Odyssey? Yeah. Yeah. Stanley Kubrick was warning against man depending on electronic artificial intelligence yeah. to create you know, his new world order. See. Well, Stanley you know Kubrick saying? is Jewish. They we know about Stanley Harvard. Kubrick. You know, well, we know about you the U.S. government doing what they do, but think about the shit we don't see. Because yeah. Esau yeah. clever in his wickedness, did, man. Did you see uh, Stanley oh, Kubrick's yeah. last film that he made? Oh, Eyes oh, Wide Shut? Yeah. And he showed you how the world really operates. You know what I mean? Uh, all the judges, doctors, lawyers, everybody were in secret and they were worshiping uh, the devil pretty much. You know what I mean? And they killed Stanley Cooper for that. What's the book he wrote? Did he write a book? Uh, uh, I I mean, have, I'm thinking William Cooper. Uh, yeah, William, have, William Cooper. Yeah. I'm thinking William Cooper. He, he I relate the, uh, that to... Uh, uh, Hell Horse, my bad. <laughs> remember <laughs> Roman <laughs> Polanski? That sounds familiar. Yeah. <laughs> he, he directed uh, Rosemary's Baby in Chinatown. But he, he uh, directed the most realistic version of one of Shakespeare's plays is called Macbeth. After his wife was killed by Charles Manson, oh, yeah, she, yeah. he was so upset, he liked this innocent hippie chick, he was a uh, uh, Polish Jew, so he was so alienated from spirituality. He was just Who, who's that? Roman Plant. Oh, Roman Plant. So he yeah, made, Macbeth, that's a good movie. Right, I got it. Oh, yeah. And he, sh he actually showed what it's like for a man to be weakened by a woman and witches and to think, oh, I'm going to kill the King of Scotland because my wife told me to. Shakespeare is way ahead of his time. Just check it out, John the Baptist is murdered because that bitch dance on the There you go. You know, Shakespeare did, did help work on the King James Bible. Uh -huh. Elizabeth and James both said that Shakespeare, he's like, he, can, he helps us calm down about all this politics. We got to worry who's killing us. We have to kill them. So Shakespeare reminded me, well, let's sit around the ground and tell, tell tales of the English kings and queens. Like, he was a Catholic in Elizabeth, Elizabeth in oh, England, oh, that's so he had a wife and children. Right. His, his son oh, was named man. Hamlet, and he died. That's why he wrote the play like Hamlet. He, he felt yeah. sad Elizabeth because his son died. You saw how she died. You saw how Jezebel died. I mean, the Anglican Church is pretty much Catholic anyway. I agree. All the Protestants, Anglicans, I don't care, it's all Catholic. They all come from the Catholic Church. They all celebrate Easter, they all celebrate Christmas. There ain't much difference between much of any of them. The only difference is one's got a Pope and one don't. You know? That's all it is. Pretty much, besides that, it's all the same. I was reading uh, about the history of it. I got this book called, by William James. It's called The Varieties of Religious Experience. And, uh, his big thing, he became a doctor and he was like a philosopher, he was an intellectual. Yeah. And so he was comparing. Hey, Brooks! You, you know who Martin Luther was? What's going on, yeah. man? So he's dealing with. There was Prussia and there was Austria, okay? There was no Germany. Hitler copied his racist things later. But he, he said, so my main enemy is the Holy Roman Empire. That was what Germany and Prussia became. Right. The Roman Empire had fallen. The Constantinople Eastern. Roman Empire of Byzantine, where uh, Constantine ruled, that had already fell, fallen. So the emperor of the Holy Roman Empire said, well, I don't want to deal with the Pope or anyone else, but these Turks are coming up, invading the gates of Vienna. Yeah. So Martin Luther, the only reason he wasn't killed is because the Holy Roman Empire said, well, the stupid guy is trying to reform. Huh? The stupid guy is trying to reform. Yeah. The, All right, I don't say I'm sorry. You got your guest service? I got my spot. Oh, you do? Yeah, I got my spot. Can you turn it on real quick? Wait, wait. I'm going to ask the, Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. I got a... Uh, <laughs> we, we got brothers coming out here. I'm trying to... I'm about to hit them up real quick. You got a password?
actually. Hey, there's already one open. This door's already strong ass sitting with cheap shit. You read this way, uh, second there's a 16. We started, uh, What's the name of your son? Seven. Seven. Uh, behold, a burning wrath of a great multitude is kindled over you. And they shot him. Come on. Come on. Great wrath. But behold, a burning wrath of a great multitude is kindled over you. Oh, it's on. What's the name of it? And feed you being idle. It's like a billion shits popping up. Oh, I see. You might just put a phone number in there.